Good morning. This is Mike Houston with your Wednesday morning weather hazard briefing for southeast Idaho. Taking a look at satellite imagery this morning, we see a high pressure ridge across the northwest states uh, with some Pacific energy working its way up into northwest Canada. Conditions are relatively dry here across southeast Idaho. We do have some low clouds here, whether the snake or a plane early this morning. And uh, we'll expect to see that hanging around uh, through a part of this morning and then redeveloping overnight tonight. Morning lows this morning. We're expected to see uh, some negative single digits here in the upper Snake Highlands and then uh, just uh, near 10 degrees for lows here uh, down in the Magic Valley uh, overnight. So pretty cold start today. We do expect that ridge to hold firm through the day today with some high clouds spilling over the top of the ridge. Most of the precipitation staying well north of us here into uh, southwest Canada. Daytime highs today after that cold start. Uh, we'll struggle to get up into the mid-teens here across uh, most of the forecast region. Uh, maybe a little warmer in some of these elevated spots in the central mountains and southeast highlands due to a better chance of mixing. Some of the valleys will stay fairly cold, however. Taking a look at our forecast clouds and precipitation, we'll jump ahead all the way to Saturday here. That ridge breaks down across the region as we have a Pacific trough now working into the northwest coast. Uh, this is Saturday afternoon, so the leading edge of the precipitation with this particular system just now reaching the western Idaho border, so relatively dry through the period. We should see temperatures warming, though, on Saturday with highs generally running up into the lower 30s in most regions. By Sunday, that uh, Pacific storm moves in through uh, Washington, Oregon, and Idaho. We should see uh, some fairly decent precipitation amounts here uh, across Idaho, probably seeing um, a fairly decent uh, shot for snowfall in the mountains for sure, uh, especially into uh, the sawtooths. That system passes off to the east. We see a second system now beginning to set up off the coast, uh, but the moisture associated with that spilling uh, through Washington and Oregon and into the central mountains here. We may even see some continuing snowfall in that region uh, Monday afternoon. But as that system continues to strengthen as it approaches the coast, most of the moisture now being uh, sent uh, further north up into Canada with relatively dry conditions uh, across southeast Idaho. And under this ridge, fairly well mixed, we should see some uh, continued warm temperatures. By Wednesday, that uh, storm system now moving inland. We're starting to see another round of precipitation uh, moving into uh, southeast Idaho. Uh, temperatures cold enough to, to support snow uh, across the region. So that's all I had here this morning. Uh, looks like we won't see any storm activity till we get uh, into the weekend and uh, through the early part of next week. If you had any comments or questions, you can go ahead and give us a call here at the number on the screen. Thank you.